For legal reasons, this is a joke. Sup, Laker Nation? It's me, Phil McCracken. Now, have you ever been to a party and you were just wondering, why isn't this in a bathroom? Well, I know I have. That's why we searched countless hours to find the best bathroom for an absolute rager. We're here in Kirkhoff on the second floor next to... But we're, we're by... We're on carpet. <laughs> so we're going to show you why this bathroom's the best for a rager. Let's head in. When throwing a party, there's one thing you're absolutely going to need. Some ladies. <laughs> and since the only ladies I know are my mom and my ex Dolores, who both said they hate me, they're not going to be able to make it. But luckily for us, there's a place where we can find some ladies right next door. Let's go check it out. Whoa. The ladies' bathroom. Mysterious, confusing, and otherwise. What the hell, man? Oh, no, no, I've been informed that legally I'm not allowed into the ladies' restroom. But luckily, I have had my suspicions confirmed. There's ladies in there. Hey, ladies, do you want to do you, do you, do you want to come to my bathroom party? Please. Well, now that we got all the ladies on campus running this way. It's time to do a little bit more work setting up our rager. Now, if there's one thing I learned from the YouTube tutorial on how to make a rager, it's that you need ice cold drinks. Now, I know what you're thinking. A cooler is the best option. Well, you're wrong. A toilet is your perfect cooler. Just stick a bag of ice in there and it can fit like a whole quart of OJ and three red Solo cups. No beers in here. Now that you got everything worked out, it's time to prepare for your guests. Put on your nicest fanny pack, pour yourself something smooth, and get ready to get radical. Well, now that you guys know how to throw an absolute rager in a bathroom, we highly suggest this bathroom here in Kirkhoff on the second floor. It's got wonderful ladies, it's got ice cold toilets, and the acoustics are perfect for throbbing music. I rate it 8.5 disco balls out of 10. That's all we got for you this time, little Lakers. And if you see me this time next week, that means security hasn't caught me yet. Yeah.